Welcome back to another video here on Slam Blocks. In today's video, we're going to be going over how Calixto and Mackenzie Turner have huge news. All of that will be revealed, so slap the like button and subscribe. Now, let's get right into this. There's a theory going on around that they are dating. Is that true though? Let's find out. What makes you want to keep a secret? Why are people slow to disclose details about themselves despite wishing to have close relationships? Confidentiality, trust, and secrets require discretion and judgment. Our secrets are tightly wired to our emotions and they pulse with a sensitive, intermittent charge along with the boundaries of our familiar internal territory. Why does exploring our secrets feel threatening? Talking about them triggers the reactive armor that covers our vulnerable places. Secrets guard our most defenseless reaches. We can be hesitant to explore these places because we fear the emotions that exposing our vulnerabilities might trigger. Often our fears rise out of the lack of understanding the situation and our feelings about it. We're not always clear why some feelings feel like they need to remain so secret. Most of us are afraid of what we don't understand and discussions in this territory can be uncomfortable. Perhaps this is even eliciting some discomfort right now. We are terrified of appearing foolish and few circumstances risk feelings of foolishness more than love. What and whom we love has direct access to our most defenseless vulnerabilities. To confess a love reveals a weakness in love and its confession can also be a strength. But that is for another discussion. By confessing a love either to the loved one or by sharing with a confidant, you expose yourself. The benefit of sharing in this way is to chance for another to hope alongside you and to share in the journey of that love. However, your confidant also shares the awareness that this love might not be returned. By sharing a love, you admit to another that you're an unpredictable path that matters to your heart. Normally, this awareness will enable the other to witness the outcome of your love. Sometimes when our loves do not resolve according to our hopes, we can feel foolish. When our love is exposed, we also introduce the possibility that our foolishness could be exposed or more accurately, our perceptions of our own foolishness. Can you see yourself in any of these examples? Did your own walls tremble just a little? Was there a recognition you weren't expecting? I hope so. I hope so because this means that now you know you're not alone in your experience. I have spoken with numerous people whose situations align with each example. I can relate to several of those examples myself. If I could, I would look you in the eye and express to you that we are all human and it is natural to experience fears like these. It can be enormously reassuring to know that the other people understand your feelings and can recognize the rationale behind your actions. This recognition is called being seen and occurs when someone else closely understands your experience. Being seen is very similar to empathy and draws on empathy's kindness. But where empathy is compassionate imagination, being seen is piercing recognition. But eventually, we will all have to let our secrets out. Keeping secrets requires deliberate effort and control. If you tell someone not to think about a white horse, they will have difficulty not thinking about a white horse. They will spend almost as much time thinking about it as opposed to not. Keeping secrets causes emotional distress depending on its nature and sensitivity. It can trigger depression, anxiety, and poor overall personal health. To maintain secrecy, it must be on constant guard not to wittingly or unwittingly reveal itself, which causes stress. For example, if a person cheats on a significant other, they might feel guilt and share. A secret that instills guilt or shame was more likely to infringe on a person's recurring thoughts. This constant vigilance creates a secrecy spiral. When the secret comes into the consciousness, the person must repress it and the guilt or shame accompanies the clandestine memory. The secret keeper must reassert through repression to avoid revealing the secret or experiencing a recurrence of guilt or shame. The secret must be put under constant surveillance to prevent inadvertent disclosure. Inevitably, the thought of the secret will re-emerge, activating the ever-tightening secrecy spiral, increasing anxiety and stress. If it is detrimental to disclose the secret, then revealing it feels not possible. The secret keeper is left in a constant state of anxiety with accompanying guilt or shame. So, one way or the other, they will have to tell the world they are dating or it will come to bite them. What did you think of today's video? Let us know down in the comment section below. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching here on Slam Blocks. We hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe. 
Also, watch the two videos on screen because I'm sure you'll love them. And with that, I'll see you in the next Roblox video. Goodbye.